homes here. Some of us think about a big house. Some of us think about a small one. But the songwriter is telling us this morning that we are but a sojourner here. We are just only passing through this land. Because we have a mansion that we are going to inhabit. Oh, praise the name of Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus. And saints of God, this morning the songwriter said, we are going to get into that city. And you know what about it? There is a heart and a crown that is waiting for us. To everything, if we're buried or if we pass off and we decide that we're going to go get a restart, of course, we maybe don't get the original six feet, right? Because they cut the number just for space. Yes, but whenever in the country they you get your original six feet, and some person will try to outdo the other one. So we get a massive sepulchre. <laughs> so we get a small one. But when they are alive, or whatever grave you get, if you don't live a life that is pleasing to God, you're not going to inherit the kingdom of heaven. Are a big one. If your life is not fitting, you're not going to inhabit the kingdom. The sun said, in that bright city. You know which one I love? He said, here's a holy and beautiful city whose builder and ruler is God. There's a part, don't need it, they said, the eye massive wall is a jasper. The city itself is pure gold. It's said, what you can imagine when my foot tear is falling. My eyes shall its glory be gold. Shall we pray the name of Jesus? Hallelujah. 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 Let me tell you something, saints of God. I, we all know what has been happening around spiritually, temporally, everything. I question, let me tell you something. One thing I'm begging the church to do this morning, not to send a pressure from your people. That's all I'm begging. Oh, praise the name of Jesus. So if you send a negative energy up here, I'm going to get that energy. I'm right here for one purpose this morning. And it's to worship the King of Kings.
Love it. Father of mankind. Yes, today, today forever, you are the same. We thank you, Lord, for your spirit life. We could have gone. We could be in our graves. We could be in the funeral home. But thanks be to God. We are alive and wet. That we can come today to glorify you. We are not better off than some of the clay today. Hallelujah. But because of your kindness and your tender mercies towards us, we are here today to honor The only thing that can separate us from you, dear God, it is sin. Only sin will separate us from you. For as long as our sins are being forgiven, hallelujah, then we know that we are able to feel your presence among us. Forgive us, Lord, of all our misdeeds, all the wrongs that we have committed before you from our birth until now. Forgive us, Lord. That we need you today to worship you in spirit and in truth. And that your presence, O oh God, will come down in this place. That sign and wonders will accomplish through your name. You have left a church on earth and you is coming back for that same church that you. That the world will accomplish that 
when you come to John, I feel not one told you that from the east, from the west, from the north, and from the south,
Your name is my people of the Ten Commandments are visited. It is coming from Exodus 20, from 1 through to 17, as Exodus 20, 1 through to 17, and St. Matthew 22, 38 through to 40. Let us all stand for the repeating of the Ten Commandments. Question I'm going to ask so once you can stand, please stand. If you are not sick and you have a baby, please stand with me. And we're going to begin. And God speak all these words.
pray to worship, go home. It is not feeling the preaching I'm telling you, and you're all sitting here laughing at it like a joke. Brother Martin, why are you laughing? Question, it is not feeling good up here. You will not understand unless you're unless you are here. And look at you down there, you're just sitting like you're, you're in the bedroom. I'm not singing a strange song, Richard, and for us to get deliverance, we have to worship. We are sitting there, we don't know what we are here for. Come on, Richard, man, if you are not here to worship, go home. And it's just the truth. It's like we are looking for something, or we are looking for someone to come for us to get a go. Virgin, let me tell you something, man. I tell you that I am up here. I came with a free will spirit this morning. And from I come up here, it's just like I, I am dead because of the church. Of Push a burden, but anybody's there. Amen. Come on, Richard, we're here. 